We are almost a month into the school year and we know a lot of families are struggling to get kids a good breakfast as they head out the door on time, on time being the key there. <laughs> Rima Kleiner is a registered dietitian and nutritionist with the North Carolina Egg Association and she is here to help us serve up breakfast in today's Mommy Matters. Breakfast is brain food. I yes. mean, that is, there's no doubt. It, it powers kids for the school day ahead. Right. So you really don't want to skip it, even if you're short on time. Right, right. Um, breakfast is the opportunity to get nourishing foods into your kids' bodies so they can really rock that day and start off strong for sure. So, yeah. You brought some cool, I, I told her, I said, this smells so good. If we had smell vision, you could smell it. <laughs> this smells so good in here. Yeah, yeah, and they're super easy to make. I mean, I have two kids. Mornings are a whirlwind. I get it. It needs to be lightning fast. So these are all meant to be very quick, easy, high protein, high nutrient breakfast. I love it. So this one is a veggie and egg frittata fingers and. There are lots of um, eggs in there. You get lots of protein, which is important for muscles, keeping us oh, yeah. feeling fuller longer so kids can focus in school. Some vitamin C rich peppers and some antioxidant rich spinach. You bake it up. You could do it the night before, a couple days before. Cut them into sticks or squares and super easy to heat up. Yeah, so and they some look appetizing too. Yeah, they're great. They look and really tasty. Yeah, yeah, and they're easy to grab and go and eat, you know, on the way. Absolutely. So. This would be something that my kids would eat. They look like it's all oh, sugar, sugar, but it's not, right? It's no sugar, actually. So kids love frozen pancakes and waffles, yes. right? Yes. But we may not love what's in them. Um, a lot of added sugar or extra ingredients. So these pancakes are protein packed. Thanks look how to how pretty this is. I just yeah. gotta tilt it up so they can see. Look yeah. how pretty. Yeah. You've got those antioxidants rich berries yes. in there and Gorgeous. some fiber rich nuts. Um, but there's ricotta cheese and eggs in there, which oh. really boost that protein really? and no sugar, like you mentioned. So, wow. really easy to make, throw in the freezer, reheat, and eat on the way. I like yeah. the fact that you have the walnuts on there, too, because that adds a lot, you know, those good, healthy fatty acids, yes. right? Yes, those heart healthy fats for sure, and lots of fiber. Yes. Yeah. This, I could do a dance for it. It looks <laughs> yummy. Avocado on the side love that too yes yes i love this because you have one minute in the morning usually so yep. this one minute actually is all it takes to cook to up this, this burrito you yep. are, you're pulling my burrito. leg here no. this is a minute it's a minute so basically you take that tortilla you put it in a bowl crack an egg in there microwave it for about 30 seconds give it a little stir microwave it another 30 seconds and then you've got a burrito you can add your favorite ingredients some cheese salsa avocado fold it up and you've got breakfast. So you can make them ahead, but they're so easy that you don't need to. And you've got a lot of protein and important nutrients like choline and lutein, which are really um, important for that brain health and keeping kids focused and rocking the school day. You know, when you're talking about grab and go out the door, that's a perfect option. That's a perfect option. This really could be too. You know, you can fold it or make a little sandwich out of it yep. and just go. Absolutely. You could put some peanut butter in the middle. Oh, you could, yeah. 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 So there are lots of options, but very easy to prep ahead of time or even just heat that morning up. I love it. I love it. So we can get these um, recipes. You, you supplied them so they'll be on our website. They're on the website. You can also get more recipes at ncegg.org. ncegg.org. Love it. Love it. All right. Check out Rima's um, website or recipes on the website ncegg.org, but also log on to Fox 8, myfox8.com and we'll have those recipes on there for you. Rima, always good to see you. You too, Cindy. She makes me hungry. Hungry, <laughs>